Dr. Meg, and this is Anatomy 101. Today we'll be talking about the arm of the mink. First off, we're going to start with the upper arm muscles. The first upper arm muscle that you can see is the dorso epitrochlearis. I don't really know. Okay. Dorso epitrochlearis. And then next to them are the two triceps muscles, both branches. Triceps brachii, right there. So then on the other side of the upper arm, you can see in between the triceps, and this is the spinodeltoid, is the brachialis, right here, the brachialis. Then underneath is the two biceps brachii, biceps brachii. This one right here is the triceps, and then this is the dorsal pitricularis from the other view. And then in between, right here, at the top of this digitorum muscle, which we'll go over later, is the pronator teres, right there, pronator teres. Okay, so now we're gonna go on to the wrist of the mink. Right here, you can see is, down across from the brachialis is the brachioradialis, right here is the brachioradialis. So now we're gonna start with this side of the wrist of the mink. As we said, this is the brachioradialis, and then right here is the extensor carpi radialis. Extensor carpi radialis. So then we have three, one, skip one, two, three. One, two, three. These are the flexor digitorum muscles. Then right in between the first two flexor digitorum muscles is the flexor carpi radialis. Flexor carpi radialis. Right in between those two. Okay, so then if you flip it over, these are some of the extensor muscles. Once again, we have the brachioradialis, and once again, we have the extensor carpi radialis. And then we have on this side, right here, this is the flexor carpi ulnaris. You can see it from the other side as well. Right here is the flexor carpi ulnaris. Then you have one, two, three extensor digitorum muscles. Right in the middle, is the extensor carpi ulnaris. And that's it for the arms of the mink. See you next time on Anatomy 101 with Dr. Mink. <laughs>